Hello, my name is Elle Marie. My call sign is KJ5LXP. I first heard about amateur radio a little bit over a year ago, but it wasn't until July 2025 when I earned my license. As an avid hiker and camper, I spend a lot of time in the backcountry where cell service isn't available. When out in the backcountry, it's important to have a reliable way of communication, and amateur radio gives you exactly that. Today, we're taking a closer look at ICOM's IC705. Up until now, we've been using handhelds out in the backcountry, but the IC705 takes things to the next level. It offers more advanced features, ease of use, wider band coverage, and higher power, all while still being completely portable. Now we're getting into the unboxing of the ICOM IC705. First off, this box is gorgeous bright, colorful, and honestly, one of the few ICOM radios that comes in such eye-catching packaging. Right on top, you're greeted with a warranty card and three different manuals, each in a different language. I love that they're well-sized and easy to read. There's also a quick reminder on how to safely remove the radio because of the antenna connectors. Underneath, you'll find the power cable for external power connections, a couple of mic adapters, and two extra fuses, which is always nice to have on hand. Then we get to the microphone. It's compact with quick access buttons for common functions and a sturdy belt clip. You really have to press it down to open it, which gives it that quality feel. What's cool is that the mic also doubles as a speaker mic. You'll find both an input jack and a speaker jack. And now the radio itself. It comes wrapped in a protective bag and feels surprisingly solid yet lightweight when you pick it up. The design is sleek and purposeful. Everything feels like it's in the right place. The battery doesn't come pre-installed, but it's the same one used in ICOM's handheld line. To attach or remove it, just press down on the two release lashes on the back. They're firm, which actually makes it feel secure when it's locked in. There's also a tripod mount on the bottom, perfect for tabletop or portable setups. Once the battery's on, let's power it up. You'll see the classic ICOM splash screen, followed by your battery level and power readout. Simply connect your favorite antenna and you're on the air. Where I think this radio really shines is its display. It's full color, touch enabled, and incredibly responsive. You can tap around to change frequencies, open menus, or pull up the scope view to see the live spectrum and waterfall display. And even outdoors, it's bright and easy to read. Overall, by initial feel, it's an incredibly well thought out design. Lightweight, feature packed, and ready for the field straight out the box. While the design is impressive, here are a few quick specs that make the ICOM IC705 stand out. It covers HF through 70 centimeters. That's HF, six meters, two meters, and 70 centimeters. It supports SSB, CW, AM, FM, and DSTAR, ICOM's digital voice mode. It supports up to 10 watts with external power or five watts using the internal battery. It has a 4.3 inch full color touchscreen with real-time spectrum and waterfall. It has built-in GPS, Bluetooth, Wi-Fi, and a micro SD slot for logging or firmware updates. It also uses the same BP272 lithium ion battery like Icom's handhelds do. It also has a USB, mic, and speaker ports, and a BNC antenna connector, all the while just weighing about two and a half pounds with the battery included in that weight. Basically, it's a full feature shack you can throw in your backpack, and it's perfect for soda, poda, or any off-grid adventure. And you know what? That's exactly what we did. I took the 705 out to a Parks on the Air site, and we even ended up doing a mountaintop excursion with it. I'm beyond impressed with what this radio can do, and I'm really excited for you to see both of those full videos coming soon. The portability of this radio, combined with its level of sophistication, is one of the reasons it stands out. It may not be the smallest rig out there, but it's definitely one of the most capable for its size. And honestly, 5 watts can really surprise you. We were able to activate a park and later make contacts from the mountainside with it. It's an incredible radio, and that's exactly why I had my eyes on it. I love to hike, I love to move around, and it fits perfectly into that lifestyle. I can throw a lightweight antenna and the 705 into my backpack, and that's it. I'm ready to go. And it's not just great for activations. It's a solid emergency communication setup for anyone who spends time outdoors, especially for hikers like me. 
And that wraps up the unboxing of the ICOM IC705. First impressions, this radio is truly something special and it's definitely gonna be a go-to rig for many field operations. If you like this video or learn something new, definitely hit that like button or subscribe button so you don't miss out on the next adventure. Many thanks to ICOM for loaning me the 705 for this series. And thank you for being a part of my amateur radio journey. And with that, I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Emergency situations. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, um, okay. Important to have a rock. How's my hair? Is it in my face? <clears throat> Wait for the wind. Was I recording? I was. If you're curious, if you're cur 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 curious, oh my gosh. What do I say? What do I say? Yeah, no. Um, I don't think I'll pick it up, but. It'll pick that up, yeah. Oh gosh. Was I recording? Okay. Yeah, it actually was recording.